two years and one month ago, I got this string trimmer from Lexmark's 567. It has been absolutely flawless in the two years that I've had it. The only problems I have had are in the cutter head at the end there where the string is where you wrap the string around it has two thin plastic wings and one of those wings just vanished I actually had the wing however there's no way to re-glue it or do anything with it but it still works without it in addition to that the blue shield that's on it one of the bolts in that was stripped out out of the box that wasn't a big deal it's tight enough and it's fine and also the handle on it over there uh, like one of the bolts I guess vibrated out or something I just put a long screw with coarse threads on it through that and a washer and it's been holding fine so basically I've been able to patch it together but it did have a six-year warranty these were the most meanest surliest bastards I have ever dealt with they fought me tooth and nail they wanted 64 pictures of everything okay 16 but close enough and even then they're like no we're denying your warranty claim why not it was defective out of the box well your receipt shows that it was purchased six months ago I said yes I purchased it in preparation for the upcoming season I'm not gonna wait until the season in order to go and try and buy one but everybody else has bought them and it was just a pissing match back and forth they were total fucking pains in the ass about everything and it took six more months but they finally finally made good on that damn warranty so um, first year started and ran great second year started and ran great this is the third year so we're gonna see if it'll started and ran great I put some freshly stale fuel in there that fuel could be two years old that's fresh for the girls we date so that's all I have done so far the tank was nearly empty so there was only a little galosh of fuel in there and let's see if it's going to start for 2022 let's see if I can remember how to start this well I should turn it this way so I can operate it easier let's see it should be in line there so we got to go to start and the primer Seven, eight, nine, ten. So ten pulls up, ten primes on that, and pull the rope till she fires. Let's see what's going to happen. So that wasn't bad at all. Five poles or so, I mean it's two cycle, that's what you get. Yes, it revs up. So there we go. That's gonna do it. I just wanted to get the startup of this. It's almost time to mow don't know if i'll get a startup in the mower probably not but i wanted to get the weed whacking out of the way thanks so much for watching make sure you click like make sure you click subscribe and even with all of the trouble i had with the cutter head and the handle and the other stuff a i was still able to patch it back together and b they eventually did make good on the warranty claim but that engine is absolutely solid all right. Thanks again for watching. I really appreciate it. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.